Hi everyone, my name is Talia and today I'll be talking about the last episode of Magical Warfare and I can say I'm pretty annoyed about it and about the whole series as well <sighs> especially the last two or let's say like three already episodes kind of annoyed me because I don't know, there's so much going on, the pacing is so bad, and a lot of things don't even make any sense. So I have a whole list here, and it's mostly like questions like why? Like, why can Kurumi change, like, by kissing? And why did she have to kiss Hotaru? Like, I don't get it, like, what does that have to do with anything in the story? She tried to get away, she didn't. Well, she kind of did, I don't know, like it's it's so confusing, like I said, the pacing is just really bad and it's just really badly written, I guess, like I don't know, I'm really not happy with how this series turned out, I hope there won't be a second season, but probably, I'm probably not gonna watch it anyways, but like for the first few episodes, I was kind of not excited, but I was kind of liking it, so I was looking forward to see more but then the more episodes I saw the more I was like this doesn't make any sense like what are they doing and then Gecko came around and he's just so annoying it, it's like he's on his periods all the time because he doesn't know what he wants and he's just so annoying I oh I don't know like he changes his mood all the time so <sighs> And of course the mother dies, um, I think everyone kind of saw this coming, especially from this series. And then also you had that um, Kurumi wanted to escape from the building and the two people helped her. Um, but then Takeshi, or Takeshi or whatever, I don't, I don't even care, but um, he goes into the castle as well to find her and they're just fighting and I don't get it like they helped her so why are you fighting you can just tell them that she is somewhere else but no they have to fight first like that wasn't we didn't need that in the series but yeah I guess they wanted to add that for more entertainment that kind of failed but yeah um, after that there was a really really bad pacing because he was in front of his front door and then Gecko was there, killed his mom and then the big fight started. Now actually the big fight is where all the stupid stuff happens because uh, Kurumi is like oh uh, Takeshi where are you and you can clearly see they are the center of the attention so you could clearly know if you were her you would know where he is because it's like everyone was looking at them so I'm like really like okay yeah she she's blonde so she can't help it I guess um, and then Gecko stabbed her because she was trying to hook Takeshi so I was like well okay some more drama why not and then Mui was trying to heal her I guess or I don't know what she was doing and then my question was what about Mui and Takeshi like didn't they have something as well like now he's protecting her like the blonde girl uh, Kuru Kurumi and I thought he kind of had interest in Mui so they didn't really go further with that story either so I didn't really understand what the point was of that whole thing then like do they just want it to add like some stupid romance and dra drama just to make it more cool or fun or I don't know. Sorry, I'm just really annoyed. I don't. I have so many questions for the people who made this because it doesn't make any sense, and I just uh, I don't get it. And then at the end, they're fighting the. What, I think it was the principal of that whole school. Um, I can't remember her name, but anyway, she was firing something up, and they got caught, or I don't know. But in the middle of the fight, apparently. Uh, like nobody really knows what happens in this series Takeshi gets back in time so then I was like really like back to the future so he's gonna try to make everything right again oh but wait Gecko is there too so 
doesn't make any sense. So yeah, you can kind of see where I'm going here probably. So overall for the series, uh, I gave it like two on Hemingway or something I thought. So two out of ten. It's the best I could give it. So. Um, yeah, I, I still have a lot more questions and stuff I want to talk about, but this video is going to be way too long if I do that. So yeah, <laughs> I do hope you enjoyed this video and there will be more Final Impressions coming up. I hope not as bad as this one because this is definitely the worst one from this season and they weren't all that great anyway, so I don't know, you can think what you want about it so let me know in the comments what you thought about it and I will see you soon bye